Item number SCP-3695. Index the surfboard. Object class safe. Special containment procedures. SCP-3695 should be kept in a standard containment locker when not in use. During all experiments, SCP-3695 should remain tethered in some way to the research team so as to prevent the loss of the object. In the event that SCP-3695 is lost in a body of water with a direct path to the Pacific Ocean, search teams are to converge around approximately 20 degrees 51 minutes north, 156 degrees 41 minutes west, off the coast of Emily's Beach, Lahaina, Maui, Hawaii. A large orange identification wrap has been placed on SCP-3695 to aid in recontainment. Description SCP-3695 is a surfboard that is capable of manipulating the currents of any body of water it is placed in. SCP-3695 will use water currents to propel itself through bodies of water towards the aforementioned location of the island of Maui. SCP-3695 appears to be capable of rudimentary pathfinding and will take detours in the event that the shortest path to Maui is not possible. In the presence of opposing water currents, SCP-3695 is capable of progressing towards Maui but may travel a different route. SCP-3695 has been prevented from reaching its final destination, so the specific location the object travels to is unknown. However, a likely candidate for the destination is detailed in Addendum 3695-2. Addendum 3695-1 on 2-18-2018, a research team attempted to pinpoint the location that SCP-3695 attempts to travel to. Using a tether attached around the center of mass of SCP-3695, the object was dragged at an angle 30 degrees clockwise from the direction the object was pointing in. This allowed the research team to approach the destination of SCP-3695 without letting the object reach it. After narrowing down the location to within one kilometer, SCP-3695 was retrieved and returned to storage. A diving team was deployed to determine the exact location within the search area, the results of which are detailed in Addendum 3695-2. Addendum 3695-2 On 2-25-2018, a diving team succeeded in finding a likely candidate for the location SCP-3695 attempts to travel to. An unidentified body was found on the ocean floor, covered in coral and various other sea life. Due to the containment protocols in place for SCP-3695, removing the corpse was not necessary. Foundation personnel that were sent to Maui showed various locals a picture of SCP-3695 and were able to confirm that the previous owner of the object was Connor Crane, a 24-year-old male who used to be very active in the local surfing community, but went missing 10 years prior to the retrieval of SCP-3695. As Crane was determined not to have died in an anomalous manner, his parents were contacted through local authorities and notified of his passing. They requested that his remains stay where they are, as that's what he would have wanted.